Hello everyone. In today's video, we are going to see the differences between active transducers and passive transducers. Basically, electrical transducers are classified into two types. They are active transducers and passive transducers. Here, active transducers. An active transducer generates an electrical signal directly in response to the physical parameter and it does not require an external power source for its operation. So, there is no power supply requirement in an active transducer. For example, if you consider this piezoelectric sensors for generation of charge corresponding to the pressure or photovoltaic cells for generation of voltage in response to the illumination, light energy, that is active transducers. And now let's see passive transducers. Passive transducers, passive transducers operate under energy controlling principles which makes it necessary to use an external electrical source means it will consume power in order to generate the output signal. They depend upon the change in the RLC electrical parameters. RLC. R means R represents resistance, L represents inductance, C represents capacitance. Strain gauge. For resistance, strain, for resistance change in response to the pressure, this is the example of the strain gauge. And thermistor. We need power in order to operate these transducers. Thermistor. For resistance change in response to the variation in the temperature. Thermistor has positive coefficient, positive temperature coefficient, negative temperature coefficient with respect to the change in the temperature and resistance. Active transducers are self-generating devices. Means it will generate by itself, no need of external power source. But in case of power transducers, I mean passive transducers requires power which operates under energy conversion principle. Here energy conversion principle is involved. How? Here we are converting the physical parameter energy. I mean the, me the measured physical parameter is converted into another form, right? So we are converting the energy. Energy conversion principle is involved in this active transducers and generates an equivalent output signal. For example, from pressure to charge. From temperature to electrical potential, here the energy conversion happens. There is no power consumption in this case. Thank you so much. If you find my video worth watching, please do subscribe to my channel.